Seeker 9000 and Seeker IQ version 3.00.1 and later, you can log in with Basic Auth or an external identity provider in a new centralized authentication platform that runs on Microsoft Internet Information Services. To add and manage identity providers, users must do this through the Secure IQ Identity Management. When a user logs into Secure IQ Identity Management page with elevated privileges, they will be able to manage which identity provider they will use. JCI will not restrict or manage which providers customers will add. From the External Identity Providers tab, you can add and manage external identity providers. These include Google, Facebook, OAuth 2.0 and ADFS. From the SAML Identity Providers tab, you can add and manage SAML Identity Providers. This now includes Okta. When logging into Secure IQ, you can log in using Basic Authentication or Auth Single Sign-On. Basic Auth uses a username and a password that has been configured in the Secure database. Auth uses a local Secure 9000 Auth operator login or a third-party identity provider and stays logged on across Secure application. In this example, the user is logging into Secure IQ using an Auth operator created on Secure 9000. The following example is using the third-party identity provider Okta to log in to Secure IQ. An operator has been created on Secure 9000 containing the email address in the OAuth identifier field that is associated with the Okta user. The same Auth login can be carried out on Secure 9000. To reset the administrator ID password, you cannot reset the Auth administrator password in Crossfire or the settings menu in Secure IQ and the Secure portal. The Auth administrator password must be reset on the identity management page as it resides on the Auth service. To reset the password, log in to the Auth administrator account and navigate to ID admin reset password. Enter the username, current password, and new password. Once complete, click the Reset Password button. Once you have reset the Auth Administrator password, you must update the Encrypt Auth Info application. The Encrypt Auth Info application makes Crossfire aware of the Auth in IIS services. To reset an Auth password, you must also reset it on the Identity Management page. However, Unlike the Auth Administrator password, you must also reset the Auth password in Crossfire. To reset the password, log on to the Auth account and navigate to Username, Reset Password. Enter the username, current password and new password. Once complete, click the Reset Password button. Once you've reset the Auth password, you must also reset the password for the corresponding operator in Crossfire. If you have initially reset the password for the Auth account in Crossfire, you do not need to reset the password again on the Identity Management page.